Welcome everybody. Um, we're gonna wait a couple minutes to get started, make sure everybody's here. So just sit back and relax, open your little goodie boxes and uh, eat your cookies and popcorn. Hopefully you guys all got those boxes. So um, it's uh, 401, I think we'll wait about one more minute. So just hang out with us, enjoy the music. We've got DJ Rob here playing us some music. Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome, welcome all. Hope you're feeling good. It's Thursday, weekend is right there. Yeah, and we have some sunshine, which is another great thing. <laughs> been a while since we've had a sunny weekend been a minute yep. so looking forward to it everyone looking yeah forward. definitely all right it's 402 so i think we can uh we can get started so um thank you everybody and welcome um today we are going to celebrate great the end of the trip incentives program um i'm melissa zampatella i'm the executive director for the alewife tma and I'd like to introduce you to Rob, um, our DJ, our DJ extraordinaire. If you've been to some of our trivia events, you, you will have met him before. So we hope you um, all got our goodie box and that you have it with you and you're enjoying yourselves. So um, we're gonna get right into it right now. So let's go on to the next slide. Um, so I'm gonna just tell you, uh, a little bit about what today's agenda is going to be. We're going to tell you a little bit about the TMA mission, um, a quick overview of the trip incentives program, and then I'm going to turn it over to Rob to award the prizes. So a little bit about us, the Elwife Transportation Management Association. Um, hopefully many of you um, are familiar with us by now, but the Elwife TMA is a uh, public-private partnership. It's a nonprofit organization, and it's made up of office buildings, residential properties, and businesses in the LY Fresh Pit Pond area. And we all work together to mitigate traffic, improve our air quality, and reduce single occupant driving. Um, and the reason that you are, we're all able to participate in this program is because you work in an office building that is a member of the Alewife TMA and your property managers pay um, a membership fee into the TMA and therefore you're um, eligible to participate in all of our programs. So T, um, the Alewife TMA is managed by Transaction Associates, which is a full service transportation consulting company and shuttle provider. So we're gonna start with a quick polling question. So the question is, which economic sector produces the most greenhouse gas emissions? Is it agriculture, which is your fertilizers your and your livestock waste? Is it the electricity sector, your commercial and residential um, buildings that produce, you know, your, your lights and your, your electricity, your heat and all that good stuff, uh, transportation, trains, planes, automobiles, um, or is it um, industry, which is, you know, the smoke and chemical waste that comes from, from industry? Give you guys a couple of minutes and then we'll get to the answer. All right. Great. So we have, looks like agriculture and transportation, 50-50. Okay, guys. Um, so the answer is, dun, 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 dun. it is transportation. So transportation, according to the EPA, transportation uh, produces about a third of all the greenhouse gas emissions in the United States. And this is, you know, comes primarily from burning fossil fuels from our cars, trucks, ships, trains, and planes. And surprisingly in Massachusetts, um, transportation accounts for about 42% of greenhouse gas emissions. So 
When it comes to transportation, uh, Massachusetts is behind the eight ball compared to the rest of the country. So we have a lot of work to do. So trip incentives, um, you know, thank you everyone for participating. Um, this program was started it through a grant that we were awarded um, with MassDOT. And the, the program worked where anybody um, that participated would receive $5 a day for using green trips and then up to $50 a month and up to $200 for the life of the program. Uh, this went on for about a year. It started last August and ended in June. So um, thanks everybody for participating. I think you'll be really impressed when you see the numbers and how well we did. So here we go. Um, how well did we do? <laughs> um, so overall, there were 85 participants. Um, and of those 85 participants, you guys commuted 9,500 green trips, which is 70,000 miles um, of green commuting. You saved $35,000 compared to driving alone. And the building with the most participation was 75 Molten Street. We gave away over $11,000 in gift cards. And the mode with the most trips was transit and biking was a close second. So now I'm gonna turn it over to Rob to give out the awards to our uh, wonderful commuters. So awesome. take it away, Rob. Thank you so much, Melissa, really appreciate it. Hey everybody, how's it going? Again, my name is Rob, I'm from Smart Trivia. Here to give out a whole bunch of awards to some amazing people and organizations for doing this, some great work this year. So yes, on to the awards we go. And the very, very first award I'm going to give tonight, we have the award for the partner with the most participation. In recognition for their efforts with the LYF TMA area to reduce traffic congestion and improve air quality, as a group and that partner with the most participation the winner is it's longfellow real estate congratulations longfellow real estate again they are the trip sentence grant partner with the most participation located at 100 125 and 150 cambridge park drive 26 commuters here logged over 2700 trips combined 4494 saved 400,990 sorry, $4,494 in savings compared to driving alone. Over 7,000 pounds of greenhouse gas is reduced. Way to go. And again, congratulations going out to Longfellow Real Estate. Uh, yeah, our partner with the most participation. So yeah, thank you so much. Again, congratulations. Uh, we're going to keep going. We have another award to give out. This one for the employer with the most participation again in recognition for their efforts with the LYTMA in, uh, yeah, in the area to reduce traffic congestion and improve air quality as a group and this time the winner is for biopharma that's right this time the employer with the most participation located at 100 cambridge park drive it's for biopharma 10 commuters together logged over 1,300 trips combined $2,174 in savings as compared to driving alone. That's around 3,400 pounds of greenhouse gas produced. Uh, yeah, way to go. That's a, that's a great team working together. So way to go for BioPharma. Congratulations. Rob, can you speak up a little bit? I can speak up a little bit. All I right. I think the music's, at least from me, my vantage point sounding you out just a little bit. Yeah, absolutely. Apologize. I could turn that off a bit. Uh, yeah. So yeah, Vore Biopharma, again, congratulations to the employer with the most participation. We've got another award coming up, and this time this is for the individual commuter with the most bike trips. That's right. This is for the commuter that has logged the most bike rides based on the number of trips recorded online at ecommuter.org during the duration of the program. And this award is going out to Hope Danielson. That's right, congratulations, Hope. Uh, you see the picture there, Hope with the bicycle. Awesome job uh, from in Biosciences, located at 75 Molten Street. That's a TMA member from the Davis Companies. Uh, Hope Danielson logged over 300 bike trips. I'm exhausted just thinking about it, but great job, Hope. That's incredible. 
$597 in savings alone compared to driving. Uh, 921 pounds of greenhouse gas is reduced just just on your own hope that's amazing so congratulations you earned earn that award for sure uh, and you got a whole bunch of new biking gear to go with it so congrats on the award you can see the headlight the bag uh i think it's a high vis vest awesome awesome so congrats hope uh next one we've got the hope uh, sorry we've got the commuter with the most miles this is the commuter that's traveled the furthest distance uh based on the number of high, highest overall miles recorded at ecommuter.org of any green transportation this is any green transportation mode during the program duration so this does include transit mile this does include transit miles and the winner of this one it's hema kazan nathan so congratulations hema highest number of overall miles recorded and also from in biosciences uh from the 75 malt street commuting from all the way from haverhill massachusetts so definitely a great way to log the miles coming all the way down from there that's amazing though watch uh i mean check it out you got some 200 transit trips you got 23 walking trips 99 shuttle trips seven carpool trips that's that that's some variety that's a lot of usage of all the great methods of transportation uh and over seven thousand miles recorded four thousand hundred twenty five dollars in savings compared to driving and over six thousand pounds of greenhouse gases reduced so way to go hemma cast and nathan you're getting some wireless earbuds wireless earbuds and the transit strap so check that out great job congratulations uh all right next award coming up we have the commuter with the most walking trips based on the number of walking trips and miles reported at ecommuter.org during the program the mate duration and the winner of this award is Corey Perez that's right congratulations Corey with the most walking trips and miles from Kintai Therapeutics located over at Cambridge Discovery Park it's a TMA member from the Bullfinch Company, uh, walking 3.78 miles each day, 400 miles total, $267 in savings compared to driving alone, individually saving 400 pounds of greenhouse gases. Uh, congratulations, you've won a Fitbit Charge 4. Might also need a new pair of shoes based on that kind of mileage, but congratulations, Corey Perez, way to go. And uh, yeah, we've got another award to give out this time. It's for the commuter with the most carpool trips. So this is again based on the number of carpool trips reported at ecommuter.org during the duration of the program. And big congratulations is going out to Lauren Beach. Congratulations, Lauren, for the most carpool trips. Again, from America, from Omega Therapeutics, also over at Cambridge Discovery Park, a TMA member from the Bullfitch Companies. That's logging 110 miles each day from Plymouth, recorded over 258 carpool trips. That's saving over $5,564 versus driving alone, saving 9,000 pounds of greenhouse gases. Way to go. Uh, yeah, you can see there that prize, getting a $100 gift certificate, get your car washed, detailed, get it all taken care of, because uh, yeah, that carpool is doing some work and it deserves a little bit of love. So congratulations, Lauren Beach. Thank you so much. Uh, I think we've got one more. That's right, just one more award. And this one, this is just an award we're giving out to just one random participant. We're giving out an award just to say thank you. One random person has been chosen to, as a thank you to say, yeah, appreciate you all being a part of the program. Thank you to recording at least for recording at least one green trip during the program duration. And the winner of this award is it's going out to Alice Long. So congratulations, Alice. Again, the random prize drawing winner uh, from GlaxoSmithKline over at 200 Cambridge Park Drive, a TMA member from the King Street Properties, uses both transit and walking logs over 300 trips, over $403 in saving, 300, over 300 pounds of greenhouse gases reduced. Alice Long, congratulations. Thank you so much for being a participant of the program. And yeah, you are the winner winner of the drawing and just like that that is all the awards we have to give out tonight i'm going to turn it back on over to melissa thank you so much for having me i appreciate y'all being here congratulations to all the winners you are amazing thanks so much for all you've done for the environment and uh yeah all you've done for your fellow commuters great thanks so much rob that was great um congratulations to all of our winners and to everybody um, that participated in the program and contributed to cleaning up the environment and reducing our traffic congestion. Um, 
I would like to say that, you know, please, this, this program's over, but please do keep in touch with us. We will be sending out our regular newsletters and you'll be receiving um, notifications from us through your property managers and employers. We will be definitely doing more incentive programs like this. In fact, um, in September, we have a, a bike challenge that we hope a lot of you will participate in. There's uh, going to be more recording of bike trips and you'll be able to participate and compete against people all across Massachusetts. So be on the lookout for that. There'll be some great prizes. And um, just, you know, our other programs, please, uh, you know, play around in e-commuter and look for your uh, carpool match and our upcoming webinars and the free emergency ride home program that you're all able to take advantage of by being members of the LWIFE TMA. So thanks again, congratulations, and um, have a wonderful evening. We will be mailing out the prizes to our winners um, before the end of this week. So be on the lookout to those, for those. Have a wonderful evening. Thanks for joining us tonight. Thanks a lot, everybody. Take care. Congratulations, everyone.